Welcome back everyone to more of The Witcher. Now, it seems we have a skill point. Let's distribute that. Uh, I guess Quinn intensity. Oh, I haven't really used it in a while. It's kind of odd, but I mean, there's no points in not getting it. So we're gonna do that. Um, we're gonna put this down here, and that's just a magic trap. Um, mutagen. Hmm. Guess they're all. We can go to alchemy and see if we can make a blue. And a green. And a greater green. So great, very green. Ah, white gold, right. Hey. This does it even scale? Sun intensity, yeah. Plus 118 percent. Nice. Thank you. Think I know how to free Dandelion. Got a plan, but we need Dudu. Gotta find him. This plan. What is it? Our Doppler friend will assume Menga's form. Order Dandelion move to Oxenfurt. We can grab him on the way. Brilliant. But how do you aim to find Dudu? You're his friend. Any idea where he might be hiding? With the Doppler, the question's never where, but as whom. In the past, facing trouble, he'd disappear, then reappear on the morrow with someone else. But this time... This time he hasn't returned. Hmm. Known Dudu Long? I know this might sound strange, but... I can't be sure. It seems he'd been circling me for some time in various forms, trying to attract my attention. Can't blame him for making the effort. Thank you. I failed to notice him at first. Then he decided to shoot the moon, assume Dandelion's form. What tipped you off? How do you know it wasn't Dandelion? Do you do not much of a singer? No. He simply spoke about something other than himself. Ah, of course. We need to convince Dudu to reveal himself. Any friends we could leave a message with, someone he trusts. Dandelion? Irina Reynolds' troop, that's all really. Not certain he was friendly with anyone else. Spent dawn till dusk with the troop, on stage or in the crowd. So he liked going to the mummings. Yes. I'm actually surprised he didn't come to us after it all happened. He certainly could have counted on the Foxen's help. Hmm. So if these mummers are ready to help... We need only mention Dudu. Irina and company are deeply indebted to him. Hmm. Dudu and the mummers. How'd they meet? That was my doing. Some opening night. Maxim lay comatose in his wardrobe, drunk as an otter. I thought of Dudu. Hard to imagine a better actor than a Doppler. And Dudu revealed himself to them just like that? I didn't think it wise to tell anyone. But Dudu and Irina took to each other completely and right away. He fell so hopelessly in love with the theatre. That he started performing with you? Yeah. Now Irina feels terribly guilty. They let him put himself in danger. She can't forgive herself. Maybe we could use a play. You know, work a message to Dudu into something. Lure him out of hiding that way. Not a bad idea, but I doubt a few lines would suffice. Besides, do you really think Dudu whiles away his days attending mummings he knows by heart? So what do you suggest? We must write an entire new play. From scratch. What? Something grand. <sighs> something that will grab Dudu's attention. So most importantly, it must have a splendid title. It must be the talk of the town. If you wish, we can start on it right away. That takes time. What? <laughs> Not sure I'm cut out to write a play. Maybe you're better off doing this on your own. It's sure to go quicker if you help me. You'll see. We'll have a grand time together. Alright. 
All right. Guess we can start writing the play. Any ideas for the plot? Actually, I was hoping... The key is to convince Dudu that he can rely on you, and that we wish to free Dandelion. The message must be clear, though naturally woven into the play's dramaturgical essence, meaning we need an appropriate dramatic structure. Following along? Uh... More or less? More or less. That'll do. <laughs> now to find the proper expressive form for our content. A gripping, contemporary story, that would be best. Perhaps about the condottieri of Povis. I know. Lorenzo Moller. A tale of a handsome but ruthless bandit, and the Doppler who manages to fool him. But now the Doppler must hide, and can only count on the help of his friend, who's a witcher, who in turn is prepared to do anything to save his daughter. No, better. His beloved. Hmm. What do you think? Good idea. Sounds great. Really think so? Lorenzo Moller. Yeah. Hmm. Or perhaps not. Wait, I've got it! We shall stage a story of the Urchin of Erlenwald. Secret lovers, their betrothal, a curse, a cruel queen, bell sounding midnight. But... At which point he reveals his face. He's a monster. There to steal Princess Pavel. They want him dead, but at that instant, a witcher steps in. And everything ends splendidly. So it's settled, yeah? You wish to say something? <laughs> uh, need a good title. <laughs> we need a good title. Venture to say that's Fuck more it. important than the story itself. I have some ideas. Perhaps you can choose. Gonna consider my opinion this time? Of course. We're partners in this. I'm just in charge. I have two really good ones. The Doppler's Salvation and A Changeling Rescued or The Witch's Triumph. Which do you prefer? Uh. Let's go with The Doppler's Salvation. It's shorter, catchier. Just one problem. No Dopplers in that story. Just a princess and a cursed urchin. Nothing simpler. We need merely swap the Doppler in for the urchin. The message, that's what's important. A witcher arrives and saves the Doppler. Got it? Hmm, all right. So it's a comedy. I was thinking more along dramatic lines. But if you prefer something lighter... Listen, merely decide and I'll get to work. Uh... Sure, dramatic, whatever. Hmm, you're right. A drama'd be better. Very well. I must get to work. While well, you must pick a corner, sit down, read silently, or just think. All right? Fine, since you don't need help with the writing. Geralt, wait. A rhyme for Witcher? Uh, did Itcher? Ugh, just keep quiet. I'm a warrior, not a poet. <sighs> Done. <laughs> I could make a small masterpiece of this had I a bit more time, but... We're fresh out of that. The hidden message to Dudu. What did you weave in? Hidden message? You were gonna work something in, like come to the Kingfisher at dawn, or... That wouldn't be in keeping with the tone of the play, not at all. You wrote it to contact Dudu. That was the purpose. Fine. <laughs> oh, fuck it. So how do you see this working? <laughs> I don't know. I was counting on recognizing him by his scar. Or just improvising. Shall we worry about that later? First, you must take the script to Madame Irina. Sure you know where to find her? The troop performs in the butcher's yard off the main square. Join us later. See ya. Faggot. <laughs> I feel like I'm just getting dragged along to this event. This is where Madame Arena's troop performs. Yeah, 
but you can only enter with a ticket. There's no performance now. Mamas are just rehearsing. Process is interesting to observe, though. So, want a ticket? No performance. Said so yourself. You can still get a ticket. What'll it be? Need a ticket. Axie. What the, what the give me a ticket <laughs> axi yeah one here just stay out of sight hey eh? awful bashful these mamas in rehearsal whatever Say that. But I'm completely fine with having swords equipped. Truth is, we're already dependent on the black one. Where the I have a feeling that I'm gonna have to wear my my outfit again. <laughs> the nightmares return. Am I misunderstanding the definition of casket? When they just have a casket in a drawer, I mean, I guess it can be defined as a small, a smaller box, but jeez, this casket, caskets everywhere. You like the bats are strapping the mug to the working man. I'm busy. Work. Sure. Boys. I guess you can sneak in the back. Those poor wretches who fled Belen. So now you know. Almost. It was almost it, but. Well, ah! What was wrong that time? I don't know anymore. It simply needs more fire. Madame Arena, can we talk? Geralt of Rivia. Dandelions told us so much about you. Is he with you? No, but I hope to bring him back soon. Here to talk about Dudu. Hmm. Let's speak in my quarters at the back of the theatre. We'll be undisturbed there. Sure? How can I help? We've not seen Dandelion or Dudu recently. Dandelion's in trouble. That much I guessed, though I am curious how serious it is. Very. Did he seduce a powerful man's wife and go into hiding? Or did he write an offensive couplet about the priests of the Eternal Fire? Worse. Lots. I'm gonna try to help him. Gotta contact Dudu first. But he's disappeared as well. I have a plan to lure him out of hiding, but I need your help. Can I count on you? Naturally, but... What can we possibly do? I want to stage a play. Something that'll really draw the crowds. I see. And you hope it'll get Dudu's attention as well, draw him here. So it must be an entirely new play? And who will write it? Priscilla, actually. She's done writing it. it tells the story of a witcher who rescues a Doppler from certain death. Mm. Sounds interesting. I'll gladly have a glance. But first, we must think about getting the word out and organizing some protection. Ushers. 
Would you mind tending to these matters? Um... Hmm, sure. Think we need ushers? A play about Dopplers could be controversial, but are ushers absolutely necessary? Can't be sure if you've attended many performances, but Novigrad crowds can be particularly... difficult. Rotten apples, tomatoes, eggs, that sort of thing? Axes, butcher's knives, and bricks, actually. Ooh. All right. Know anyone appropriate? Try the dogs, perhaps. You're bound to find some men willing to do any work for a few crowns. What about Dijkstra? How can I help <laughs> you spread the word about the premiere? Well, we'd like all the city to hear about it, so we must clearly talk to the Puffins. Who are the Puffins? Street artists. Get them to announce the premiere, and even the muscles on the harbor piling will hear about it. Where'll I find them? They did occupy some rooms in the bits in a townhouse, but I can't be sure they're still there. I've not seen them in the streets lately. They may very well have hung up their body hose. See if I can find them, and if they'll work for us. Ah, <sighs> thanks for helping. I'll come back once I've found some ushers. See you then. I feel the like I'm gonna end up poor. I just have the sneaking suspicion. Nope. It's clear as the eternal I don't know where it comes from, but Doctor's salvation. You're the it's there. Oh, Gotta be sick. Ah, it's so far away. But the city's so big. It really, the city is really just grand. Just, I mean, super. It really just feels like districts and everything. Good fight. Some nice footwork there. Challenging me, or is it hell you want to face? A Witcher versus the Beast of Metana. Killer Instinct versus Primal Rage. You guys really from Nilfgaard? We's from Plowing Metina, damn it! Oh, Nilfgaard. Raised by wild hands on the windswept plains of Magdara. Brothers forged in bloodshed. Veterans of Metina's infamous filthy arenas. Who dares face the wild men of the south? Who will look the beasts in the eye? I'm just gonna trust you. I'd like to hire you to help out. We're staging a play. Need us to kick some ass on stage. Actually want you to usher. Keep the peace. Make sure no one's ass gets kicked on stage or off. Got the wrong men. Ass kicking's what we do. How about a wager? If I beat Hal, you'll come work for me, gratis. See, Hal's no fan of money. Failed romance. Spare with these guys. So you'll need something special to convince him. Here's an idea. Take us both on. Same time. Fire the century. A witcher against the two-headed dragon of metal. What if I lose? Oh, you'll lose. But we'll still do your little job. You'll just pay us double. <laughs> sure. Fine. Fight you both. Cough up the coin first. Lose, and it stays with us. Double the wages, as promised. But if I win, I get it back. Ow! Finish him! Got something special lined up! Oh, 
Oh! Fucking. It's literally like controlling a cat with. We'll get there before any of the uh, dancing starts. And we'll keep that coin right out. Okay, let me tell you how it's like controlling Gerald in a fist fight. It's like controlling a cat with iron shackles on its leg that is being that is being thrown into a barrel filled with water. <laughs> It is horrible. Save me. This the place. Greetings, Witcher. What? It's nearby. Ready? Uh, no. Need a minute. Very well, but hurry, please. Who? Oh, this is Hattori. What the fuck? No, I'm not ready. <laughs> that quest was like level 24. Of course I'm not ready. Who do you think I am? Some kind of super, super duper guy? I could probably do it on a, on a lower difficulty, but... What was it? I have no idea what I'm gonna run into. So, I'm gonna politely decline for now. What is it, right boy? Looking for adventure? Up, up, no, no, <laughs> no. Oh, my God, so much time wasted. Oh, <laughs> my worst nightmare. God damn it, this will be the best play. The devil will ever be. Demon. Excuse me. Nice tune. Damn sad, though. Then it successfully conveys my mood. What do you seek here? Um, yeah. Looking for, Looking puffins. for the puffins. Have I found them? We've no coin. Leave us be. Think there's been a mistake. Sorry. Thought our landlord had hired another thug to collect from us. Don't want any coin from you. In fact, I'm willing to pay you, provided you agree to get the word out about Madame Arena's new play. Oh, afraid that's impossible. Ever since we premiered our fateful ballad about Holy Hemophart, who his faith ignores, gorges himself, diddles old whores, Fatso's gang has been harassing us incessantly. Fatso's gang? Common thugs, and the church's pay. City's full of gangs like that now. They threaten me, sir. Said they round off her pointy ears with a carving knife. Oh, that's rude. They don't let us perform. Chase away spectators, destroy our instruments. Lately they've taken to lurking outside our home. We're at wit's end, no clue what to do. They harm any of you? No, not yet. But it's merely a question of time. Nisa overheard talking about setting fire to something. All right. Say I get Fatso and his boys to leave you alone. Will you publicize Arena's play then? Of course! But you shan't find it easy. There's no talking to that lot. I'm not a great talker anyway. <laughs> I dare you to say it again! 
again. Hello. So you're the ones. Oh, I fat so. Look who we got here. Is it just me or you got cat eyes? Right, he does. Stray cat must have fucked his mum. <laughs> <sighs> now, what you doing in the city of eternal fire, cat shit? Leave the puffins alone. Worms that insulted our Ark Emilfart? Called him an allmonger? I'd sooner snuff out the holy flame itself. Tell them fucking poets to come down here. Shove their fruits up their blaspheming assholes. Yeah, to play a different tune then every time they fought. <laughs> uh, meh. Leave the puffins alone. Aye, we will. Alone. What the hell? Black magic. He's a fucking witch. Get him! Russell time! <laughs> Keep it together, mates! Well, I got one guy. Ah, oh, what a sight! You really showed him! <laughs> and we're just one, walking on the ashes. Ow, right in the noggin! I'll finally be able to leave my home without hiding beneath the hood. Thank you very much! Come on, it was nothing. Oh, it was something, all right? I don't dare think we've forgotten our promise. We'll strip our voices ragged praising Arena's new play. How much will I owe you? Not a copper! Helped us out. See no reason why we shouldn't help you. Get half of town to come to the play. Wait and see. Some quick preparations and we'll be out in the streets. <laughs> Till the next! Sure. Alright. Well, we have now advertised the play. Oh, I jumped over that fire. <laughs> but... What? Who? Geralt of Rivia. Witcher. White Wolf, they call you? You stand accused of offending religious sentiment. We've orders to take you in for interrogation. Surrender your weapons. Uh, no. Over my dead body. Told you we wouldn't fool him. Well, you'll do a beating. It'll just be more of a challenge. Remember the preacher who spoke of witches and witchers? A man you humiliated before his faithful. He asked that we administer a sacrament on his behalf. Your last rites. You're so tough. Really? It's quite all right. Do do da da. Doppler's in love and betrayal most wicked. Want to know What's more? Hair, Don't lately. buy a ticket. Oi! Sick of a piss This is the best advertisement I've ever seen. I'm in a rut. I have such a hard time finding it. Alright, um, well, that's it for now, so, uh, thanks for watching, guys, and tune in to the next.